Hey, in this video, I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough of our angel investor operating system in Notion. So I built this tool for myself because over the last years I've invested as an angel in tons of companies. And at some point it became very messy to have all of the data in different places. So my angel investing was living in my inbox, but also in some Excel spreadsheets. And so I decided to change that and build this operating system. And it has some elements to it and I will quickly go through them. So starting out with the deal flow page, as you can imagine, this is the basic funnel view that lets me track all of the investments from um, yeah, the intro stage or the inbound stage to the stage where I invest into the companies. And the good thing about this is that I can have always um, all information at one place and almost create my own investment memo that I can reuse for every single deal. Besides the deal flow page, I have one page that is my portfolio. So every company that I invested in, I can easily filter after companies that are already dead, that are exited. Um, but I can also see some more information around every single investment, like the number of shares that I have, the share price and the current value. And I automatically create the, um, um, the IRR and the MOIC for the investment so that I get a sense on whether my investments are performing good or if my investments are performing poorly. Besides the portfolio page, I have an aggregated KPIs page that shows some statistics on my investments and my business angel investment as a whole. So... Um, I, you, I can easily aggregate all of the portfolio companies here and get some interesting data around that. Beside that, I have created three tables around people and companies. So first one is a co-investor tab that lets me store all of the contacts that I am uh, investing with. So everything from um, yeah, VC investors, angel investors. And for me, the reason here is to store them um, in a way that I can reuse them for further deals. So either my own companies or companies that are um, fundraising in the future, I can quickly intro them to the people in my co-investor list. And then um, I created another list around founders. So I have all information around my portfolio founders like LinkedIn, but also I can store any kind of additional information. And last but not least, the companies tab that helps me store all the information in regards to a company in one single place. And that means also having this like top entity. And then for example, you can have several deals for any kind of company if they are raising a seed round, a series A round. So these are two different things. Um, beside that, I have created some t templates for myself because a lot of the um, work as an angel is communication. So I have some rejection emails, first call email templates that I can quickly use and send out to the founders that I work with. And then I created two uh, interesting things. So um, almost something like a yeah, public website or mini website. And you can easily use that from the Notion template and then share it publicly. And I created a value add page for my portfolio founders where I talk about very specifically on the things that I can help with. And yeah, this was the basic walkthrough of the angel investor operating system. Really excited to hear your feedback on that and try it out for yourself.